Two Gophers from Texas, in our Davis cartoon from 1948, in my opinion, could easily pass as a Bob Clampett cartoon. And I mean that in the best way possible. The wild and wacky animation of the 1940s Bob Clampett cartoons is something that no other director, no, no other studio could ever accomplish. The work of the greats and the great animators that worked under Clampett, like Rod Scribner, Manny Gould, and Bill Melendez, never ceased to make my jaw drop. How did he do it? But this isn't to say that some other Warner cartoons don't accomplish some wonderfully cartoony animation. Take this cartoon, Two Gophers from Texas, for example. I won't try to comment on this animation, as it speaks for itself. The cartoon is, for my money, the last truly loose and wild Warner Brothers cartoon. Today, let's look at one of these amazing scenes from this cartoon by the animation legend Emery Hawkins. It was so tough just to pick one scene to highlight for today, but I settled on this short but great one, just for this introductory episode of the Magic of Freeze Framing. That's about all the time we have for this episode of The Art of Freeze Framing, folks. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.